So, welcome back. One no, uh, well, two minutes, not even two minutes, like what, 20 seconds in, and I've already fucked up the intro. Well, anyway, welcome one and all. See, through there. In this one, I will be doing, sorry for that, a uh, legless spider, which requires me to go and see, I um, investigate some smoke, which I can't see. Well, there's apparently smoke somewhere in that direction. Either this town is very polluted and I can't see the difference. Or... Whoa! No! Oh, that's oh, nothing. Woo! Right. Or I... Um, the smoke is very small. Like a flare or something. I think it's a flare. I remember hearing something about a flare. But we'd soon see. Ah, look, flare. There we go. So, what's going on here? It's you, Crane. I've seen your face on the posters. You've got to help me. What happened to you? I took a bullet from Razor's men. I'm a runner, too. Well, almost. Look, I'm out of commission. Can you help me out? I need you to finish this run for me. Look, I'll get you to a shelter or something, but I've got other things to take care of. You don't have anything more important than this, I guarantee it. All right. Tell me what you got. The source of the epidemic. Where? David can show you. Here's a list and a bag with the things I already collected. The rest is on you. When you've got it all, take it to David. He'll tell you everything. You'll find him at the Royal Canal. Tell him Spider sent you. What about you? I've got a safe house nearby. I'll be fine. Just help David. That's all that matters. I'll help David. I mean David. So, what am I supposed to do? Collect remaining objects. <laughs> Three something part. I can't read that. Uh, where? Over there. That's easy. Ish. I'm assuming it's going to be easy, but somehow I got this gut feeling that when I get there, it'll just be some big open area with a couple of dozen zombies just roaming around. So far, all right, I am really enjoying this game. It's just got so much content in. The environment is just so interactive. The story is pretty good as well so far. And well, I can't say anything bad about, about the combat. There are, it does have its annoying points, um, like its use of that, like its use of that zombie that explodes. It's like every door you seem to open, there's one right behind it. That's a pretty good feature as well, like an x-ray. Shows you all the damage you do to them. If you like, break a bone or something. Sorry, did not mean to do that. But, it saves me the trouble of having to kill it. I tried doing a night run earlier, um, which is basically just I tried to do a, well, the assault on the office outpost, but during the night, and I, uh, no, it just didn't go well. It lasted for about five minutes, and I just, I just couldn't climb up a building, because I had volatile, yeah, vol, 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 volatiles, volatiles, whatever. Depends where you pronounce it, really, where you come from. Uh, volatile. Chasing me up the side of the building. Oh my god. Just no. When you look down, you're like, I'm safe now. 
and you look down and you go, mm, I'm not sir, I am far from safe. Which is why I do most of my missions during the day. Because I don't have to worry about athletic zombies. No, he should have broken his knee by now. One down, two to go. I can't see a little bastard as well. Um, inventory. Maybe if I have some Molotovs around here somewhere. I'm sure I... there you go. Place them. Where are they going? Dead now, right? Oh, all right, I'm not going there. Got what I need anyway. Whoa! Oh, come on. Barely took two steps over that building and I'm already being chased. Alright, that wasn't so difficult. I literally just climbed up the wall. Ah, I got more done. Going to see David, I mean David. How far is this guy? Oh, how far is good. Who's like across the city? <laughs> That's quite a run. Bye. Whoa. Hey. What's with all the violence? Can't we all just get along? 
die, you fuck. I mean, yeah, can we all just get along? I mean, I like peace. I don't like to be too violent. Why won't you just die, man? Someone should really be helping you a lot. You are hopeless. I mean, he fell off. He fell clean off that little bridge thing. Don't let me die here. I won't let you die. What is this shit? Oh! You sneaky bastard. You okay now, man? Pal? A mule? Yes. I owe you. Shit myself, man. Came out of my mic. That was really loud as well. So, uh... Who are you? Crane. Spider sent me. There we go. Why? What's happened to him? Well, he ran into Rice's people, but he'll be alright. Like, I brought the things he was collecting for you. You're a lifesaver. Thanks, Crane. This is really going to make a difference. So, tell me what this is all about. Oh, I thought you knew. Well, I know it involves the source of the epidemic. Yes, the meteorite. I know where it landed. You think the epidemic came from space? What do you think? Iran gets hit by a meteor, a bunch of guys in hazmat suits show up, and two days later, people start jumping on each other. You think that's a coincidence? You have some proof of this? I did. Rice's men just took off with my last samples. I was going to send Spider out for some more. Could you do it? Alright. Part of me thought this was serious, but... Obviously not. Find the meteorite samples. Right, I'm gonna pick another quest. Screw this. Right, now this quest I found, it was the thing, the, he's the curator of the museum, Tariq, he was with that young kid before I went to go fight Rice and Rice, keep calling him Rice, Race, uh, in the museum, and I went to go back to see him in between one of the, my videos and he gave me a quest, which is this one, and I'll be doing this one in the next part, so there should be a link somewhere. To part, no, to the next part. So click on that and I'll be doing Chasing Past. Might be fun. As for now though, hope you've enjoyed the video and I will see you in the next video. Good night and good luck. <laughs>